find a third approximation x3 to the root of the equation x square minus 2 equal to 0 starting with x naught equal to 1 but we apply Newton Raphson method. So we are given fx equal to x square minus 2 then f dash x derivative of fx equal to d dx of x square minus 2 derivative of x square is 2x and derivative 2 is 0. Therefore, by Newton Raphson method, x1 is given by x0 minus f of x0 divided by f dash of x0. That's equal to x0 as it is. f of x0, let's write f of x0 is x0 square minus 2. f dash of x0 equal to derivative of fx at x equal to x0 to x0. Let's simplify it a bit further. That's equal to 2x0. 2x0 square minus x0 square is x0 square plus 2. Now we are given x0 equal to 1. Therefore, x1 equal to 1 square plus 2 by 2 into 1 that is equal to 3 by 2 is 1.5. Again x2 equal to the process remains same uh, x1 minus f of x1 divided by f dash of x1 which upon simplifying will give us x1 square plus 2 by 2x1 That's equal to 1.5 square plus 2 divided by 2 into 1.5, which upon simplification will give us 1.416. So we have determined x2. Now let's find x3. So we have to repeat everything once again. x3 equal to x2 minus f of x2 divided by f dash of x2. Observe that uh, x2 equal to 1, okay, we can again write it as x2 square plus 2 divided by 2x2. That's equal to 1.416 square plus 2 divided by 2 into 1.416, which is equal to 1.414. 1. Now let's look at the equation x square minus 2 equal to 0. If we want a positive root, of course, x will get x equal to square root 2. Are we getting square root 2 equal to 1.41421? Yes, we are already correct up to at least three decimal places. So we observe that Newton Raphson method gives us a root at a quite an alarming pace. Just in uh, third approximation, we are obtaining accuracy up to three digit, at least up to three digit.